Lane steps, shoots, and scores! Wheeled from the goal line, and Matt Lane strikes from the second midfield, and they all lose. Got away from Busco, driving in, shoots low, five hole on the line, and Albany retakes the lead. Maloney dropping the initial pass somehow. Hey guys, what's going on? So we're back for part uh, two of the custom stringing. It is, uh, in addition to the varsity order that I said I'm going to make a second video for, I'm actually going to combine a couple of additional heads that I had going in and out of the office this week. Um, so the first is a two-part order for Mason Agostinelli, who is a local player um, at the local high school. He's a freshman there, uh, and he plays attack. So he got a Maverick-centric high school and a Maverick Surgeon um, 500. Um, so he asked for East Coast dot, East Coast mesh with the same pocket, a mid low. So the first one here it is. It's a uh, Maverick centric high school. Um, it features uh, one heavy nylon uh, triangle top string, a blue triangle white nine diamond, and another straight blue uh, royal blue straight. Um, so it came out with a really nice mid pocket that's going to shift uh, all around, really sit towards the middle and then a little bit lower, um, which is perfect for what he wanted. And then a nice channel as well. There's a face shape, really awesome. Uh, Mason, I hope you love it. Next up for Mason, and my favorite of the two, is an STX Surgeon 500 with, uh, once again, East Coast mesh, uh, semi soft. The other one had semi soft as well. And this one, um, it's the same kind of pocket, mid low. This one has two straights and a nylon, taking up the first 10 diamond row uh, with the nylon, and then the nine diamond row with the shooter, skip nine diamond row with the shooter. Here's that. I like how this one came out just a little bit more, um, just because it got a, a lot nicer of a channel. It's a really nice channel. Perfect Goldilocks. Ball's gonna be extremely snug, and it's gonna be a really accurate release for Mason. I think he's gonna like this one better just a little bit because of that more accurate release. But both are really, really solid heads. Once again, mid pocket. It's gonna shift just a little bit lower, and um, here's a face shape. And again, it has the uh, nine diamond top string, the double nine diamond top string, and. Uh, the blue triangle and uh, white nine diamond. So Mason, I hope you love it. One more head uh, and then we're gonna get back on track. This one is a head for a JV defenseman. So he has a Maverick, or sorry, Warrior Regulator that he wanted me to do up for him at the Universal Spec. He asked for me to use uh, Hero Mesh Semi Hard. So I actually have never used a piece. Um, I've used the new Hero Mesh Goalie Mesh. You guys saw me post that picture on Instagram. Strong enough for a local player. Unfortunately, I didn't have time to do a review of it. Uh, short story. It's really nice, really consistent, and it, once again, a great product from East Coast Dyes. Um, but the Semi Hard Hero Mesh is a little bit different. I'd say it's softer than 3X, but definitely harder than the Hero Mesh Semi Soft. So this one features two straights and a heavy nylon, basically the setup I like to use for defensemen. Um, it features a nine diamond triangle, double triangle top, green triangle, white nine diamond. Overall came out really clean, really nice. Uh, features a mid-high pocket, which is what he asked for, and a really nice channel. So I'm pretty sure he's going to like this one. Um, I, I just really hope he does. Next head up, we're getting back on track for the varsity order. It is a STX Surgeon 300 with a mid pocket, just really clean, shifty mid pocket, perfect just for all around uh, offensive player. Um, so it's really nice and it has a nice channel as well. And as of all the heads, it has that um, double triangle top string with the white. And then this one I decided to go two straights on the 10 diamond row uh, and then also a heavy nylon on the 10 diamond row, the first 10 diamond row and the two straights go below that. Um, so it's just really mid pocket, really shifty, really nice. This one's going to Matt McKinnon. Matt Mc Matt McKeon. Matt McKeon. Um, and I'm pretty sure I love it. So far, I've been getting great feedback from the varsity heads, and I can't wait to see what they all think. Hey guys, so we have a couple of heads to show you right now. First up, we have a Brian Clutch X with String King 3X. Um, it features a mid pocket, a really nice channel. Um, with two straights and one nylon on the row right above it. So we have two straights on both nine diamond rows and then a nylon on the ten diamond row. Features a nine diamond triangle top string. Um, this one's going to Michael Rudder, who is a attackman on the Double Art Varsity team and a uh, really solid pocket. You guys can look at that there. It's just really nice, really solid. 
Uh, it's gonna be awesome. Next up, we have a Nike Lakota U High School, or like OG Nike Lakota, um, with no nine diamond triangle, just the nine diamond um, top string, with one straight and one heavy nylon. Features again a mid pocket, which is really really nice. Really nice channel. Um, and this one's going to Matthew Unger, um, who I believe is a defenseman. I have gotten that wrong. Um, so I hope you really like this. Should be really nice. It's really a uh, nice pattern that I've worked to perfect on the Lakota U, but it transferred really nicely to the Nike uh, High School, Nike Lakota High School. I just made a couple of changes. And there is the nine diamond top string with no um, triangle in it. Really nice. And this one has String King 3X as well as the other one. Next up, we have two heads that aren't tagged yet, but I think I remember who they're for. This is for Erdman Cameron, I think. Um, this is a, pro t a superpower with a really nice mid pocket, nine diamond top string. Oh, well, you can look at that. A string King 3X, two straights, and a heavy nylon all uh, on the 10 diamond row. So this one is really, really nice. It's for an LSM, and I'm pretty confident he's going to love it. I added the extra shooter just because as a uh, LSM, in my opinion, you need to have a little bit more width. Um, and control the ball when you're throwing it with a really long stick, long arcing stick. So by giving it a little bit of a higher pocket with an extra shooter, it should be perfect for him. Um, this one's a shrinking 3X and it came out really, really nicely. Hope you love it. Next up, we have probably the most requested slash most used head out of the whole order. Where I wrote 4X with um, shrinking 3X and a low pocket. So it sits right here, but it's really going to sit lower. But I just try to push it up as much as I can because um, Pockets are going to just naturally shift low, just due to gravity, of course. So by pushing them higher and then just allowing it to naturally shift low, it gives you a really natural pocket, which is really important when you're playing. So this is the most commonly used head for all the attack, and they all got a low pocket with an uh, Evo 4X. Um, so that's pretty cool to see that they're all using that setup, uh, like I said in the last video. And this one, once again, features the 9 diamond triangle top. Uh, two straights and one nylon all, um, all in the 10 diamond rows. It starts on the first 10 diamond row uh, after the 9 diamond triangle top and then skips 10 diamond uh, shooter, skip 10 diamond shooter. Um, really nice. Uh, and this one's going out to Wade Agassi, I believe. Uh, <clears throat> he's an attackman and I'm pretty sure he'll love it. So, um, hey guys, what is going on? Jack Super String Cross here. Today we are finishing up the uh, second video for the varsity order. So this head is actually not on the varsity order, um, like most of the other heads weren't, but I wanted to throw in some other heads because I did explain to you that um, most of the heads I couldn't actually film because I had a uh, time commitment I needed to reach so I wasn't able to get a, really, a video out for all of them. But this one is for a midi on my freshman team. Um, we just finished up the majority of our season, we won our championship, and uh, a video of that is actually going to be posted probably Saturday night, so you can stay tuned for that. But anyways, um, so we kind of finished the majority of our season, so he gave me a stick. I think we have one more game, but it doesn't really count for anything. So he gave me a stick to string. Um, it had some uh, beat up String King 2S in it. So I decided to uh, do the same exact thing I did last time, just a uh, couple of adjustments. He asked for the same exact pocket. Um, the other thing I did was change the color of the triangle top string. We'll show you that in a sec. So his head, this, this mesh in particular, it's a mid pocket. It shifts a little bit higher, but shifts a little bit lower for one handed cradling, and it's really, really nice. It's just really smooth, and he uh, uses it to get a lot of control. And uh, he has a decent amount of whip in this stick because he shoots on the run a lot, and that allows him to hit some really nice shots. Um, so, like I said, I just changed the color of the top string. I just did a white triangle instead of a green, and kept the green nylon and the green in the throat. I think this looks really clean. Um, in other news, like I said, I have a ton of other awesome videos coming out. Um, a video for the new Swag Slacks, Goalie Training Balls, uh, Sock Company Review, tons of cool stuff. I'm also going to be going to the Final Four, and I'll uh, be recording that. So, that's pretty much it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and have a great day.